Oh yeah. It's here. Yeah, it's here. So you can open the vessel, open it up, open it up, and I have to see. Oh, okay. But no, I hope not. What happened with the vessel before? Whosoever liveth and believeth in me shall never die. I know that my Redeemer liveth and that he should stand in the latter day upon the earth. And though after skin worms destroy his body, yet in my flesh I shall seek out. Whom I shall see for myself, my eyes shall behold and not another. We brought nothing into this world, it is certain we carry nothing out. The Lord gave and the Lord hath taken away. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Please be seated. My condolences to the Redeemed family of Charity Jacob. Let us all sing, How Great Thou Art. I warn you, I'm not a good singer, so you all will sing along with me this morning. Fair enough? Oh Lord my God, when I in awesome wonder Consider all the world thy hands have made I see the stars, I hear the rolling thunder Thy power throughout the universe displayed Then sings my soul, my soul Then sings my soul, my soul. 
But God is son, not sparing, send him to die. I scarce can take it in that on the cross my burdens gladly bearing, he bled and died to take away my sins and sings my soul. This child, O oh Lord, you have known from her fatal days to this time. Father, if she have cried to thee, seeking mercy and forgiveness, would thou great compassion and save her grant unto this child entrance within the gates of paradise, that she too, o Lord, would sit with the company of saints to the great resurrection moment. Send forth, O oh Lord, thy Holy Spirit and thy angels to comfort now the family and those who are under her, O Lord, as they move. Let them be assured that all is well with her, O Lord, for thou art the great King, for you are the resurrection and the life. But let them all be reminded of death one day will come to us all, and thus we must make our calling and our election sure with thee. This we ask to Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen, amen, amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. Thine will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from all evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. 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 Before I go into the scriptural reading, there is one Winston, I don't know if it's junior or senior, wishing to speak. Is he here? Yeah. Could you come forward, please? Mm -hmm. Gentlemen, friends of the family and guests, I want to tell you all thanks for being here so much. I really appreciate the moral support. Normally I could talk, but today I have no feeling to talk. I just wanted to know I will consider my sister, my sister, her blood and she. She's not ordinary, she's unique, she likes to make her heart. And I just wanted to, I just wanted to have it in your heart. But I remember the good times, the bad times will come. You understand? My grandmother, my mother, all my cousins. One of the main things today, going to the strategy, uh, it's like all hands on deck, everybody, everybody, everybody participate, everybody do something little to contribute to making this day successful as we go along. But keep it in your heart, 
keep it in your mind that you will never be forgotten. Just as COVID changed the world, we have to learn to live as a new normal that my sister and I hear. That is what I have to say. Thanks very much. Reading from the 119 Psalm, verse 25, true, 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 to verse 32. Here it's starting. My soul cleaveth unto the dust, quicken thou me according to thy word. I have declared my ways, that thou hearest me. Teach me thy statutes. Make me to understand the way of thy precepts, so shall I talk of thy wondrous words. My soul melted for heaviness, strengthen thou me according to thy word. Remove from me the way of lying, and grant me thy law graciously. I have chosen the way of truth. Thy judgments have I laid before me. I have stuck unto thy testimonies, O Lord, put me not to shame. I will run the way of thy commandments when thou hast enlarged my heart. Resting at the 32nd verse, giving God the adoration and praise. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. We then same from the 109th Psalm again, from verse 41 through to 48. Here it started. Let thy mercy come also unto me, Un let thy mercy come also unto me, O Lord, even thy salvation according to thy word. So shall I have, so shall I have with, with, with wherewith to answer him that reproacheth me, for I trust in thy word. And take not the word of truth utterly out of my mouth, for I have hoped in thy judgments. So shall I have kept thy law continually forever and ever. I will walk at liberty, for I, have seek for I seek thy precepts. I will speak of thy testimonies before, the, before kings, and I will not be ashamed. I will delight myself in thy commandments, which I have obeyed, love. Thy hands also will I lift unto thy commandments, which I have loved, and I will meditate in thy statutes. Resting at the 48th verse, giving God the adoration and praise. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Reading from the book of Thessalonians, the first chapter, first Thessalonians, the fourth chapter, from verses 13 through to 18, here it started. But I would not have you to be ignorant, brethren, concerning them which are asleep, that he saw and not even as others which have no hope. For if we believe that Jesus died and rose again, even so them also which sleep in Jesus will God bring with him. For this we say unto you by the word of the Lord, that we which are alive and remain unto the coming of the Lord shall not prevent them which are asleep. For the Lord himself shall descend from heaven with a shout, with the voice of the archangel and with the trump of God, the dead in Christ shall rise first. And we, then we which are alive and remain shall be caught up together with them in the clouds to meet the Lord in the air. And so shall we ever be with the Lord. Therefore, Comfort one another with these words. Resting at the seventh, resting at the eighteenth verse, giving God the adoration and praise. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. What she going to do? She wants, she wants it. Ah, yeah. It's really a new norm, and usually it's 45 minutes, but now it's half an hour. So, you know, we, I don't want, don't find that I'm cramming any, everything, it's just because I have to work with the time. Fair enough? That's why I start a half an hour before trying to keep the five minutes period for you guys. Let us sing a hymn by the time, Blessed Assurance. Blessed Assurance, Jesus is mine. Oh, what a fortress of glory divine. 
Pearls of salvation, purchase of God, born of his spirit, washed in his blood. This is my story, this is my song, praising my Savior all the day long. This is my story, this is my song, praising my Savior. All the day long, perfect submission, perfect delight, visions of rapture, now burst on my side, age of descending, bring from above, echoes of mercy, whispers of love. This is my story. anything too serious. It never hurts to laugh. So, no matter what we are, I always use your words to guide my decisions and your strength to study. You don't miss your spirit, your strength, your amazing soul, and your laugh. Of all the things left unsaid, I just want to tell you the things that we didn't get to say. You are loved. You are worthy. You are appreciated. I know you will love this. You will always be better makeup. I couldn't tell you. 
I can not tell you that. I always want my curry to taste like yours. You know, sisters, you can say it. But most importantly, you are free. Free from pain, hurt, and anger. Free to laugh, take heart content. Free to soar, and free to fly. We love you, we miss you, and we will do right with you. Sleep in peace. <laughs> Indeed, there is a lot of pain and sorrow, but I believe she was ailing for a little time. More so, she, has in, he, she had enough time in the midst of this pain to make peace with God. That's my only thing, nothing else. What she do and what she ain't doing, I know my business, and I know body business. And if you talk about it, it ain't changing the fact she's gone home. And talking about it doesn't change the judgment of God. The world will hate a criminal and the night before he is hung or being executed, he makes peace with God, accepts his execution and the world will dictate what he was and God will take him in his arms for who he chose him to be, the thief on the cross. This is the consolation I can give to the family. Cancer like any other disease and any other sickness is not to look at it that's being something dreadful. The Western world, we in the West would say it's dreadful. But to God, it is the way which he calls us back home, true pain. The psalmist says, in my affliction, Lord, I will remember thee. For thou hast afflicted me because of the love that thou hast shown to me. Sometimes these are the things and sometimes the mistakes made, we would ponder. But it was to be what it had to be. It is, a, it is a time that we would use to find our peace with our maker and to be with God. Many of us would go, maybe the family, some of the friends maybe, after 40 days before the year is done. She fades from our memory. But God never forgets her. For all souls are mine, she says, with love. I don't want to stay long because he says, because of this love, for the souls of man and for humanity. The word incarnated came to earth and died. Ah. So with these few words, beloved, I say to you, on that resurrection morn, we pray that she too will find her peace with God. But not only her, but we all who are here. Learn from the lessons, and I leave this as a closing remarks. Learn from her lessons, how she would have prayed, I believe she would have. Then you find yourself in that position, and you start praying too, and make that peace with God. I think one of her supervisors is here, but before you come, sir, let me do the committal, and then you will talk. Fair enough? All right, so let us all stand as I do the committal. Sit down, sit down. Easy. Give me two seconds. Somebody have a mask in the Peter's in way shadow never continue in the In the midst of life, we are in death of whom we seek for succor. But of thee, O Lord, for our sins are after just this peace. Yet, O Lord of God, most holy, O Lord, most mighty, O holy and merciful Savior, 
Deliver us not into the bitter pains of eternal death. Thou knowest all the secrets of death to us. In the sure hope of the resurrection through Jesus Christ our Lord, who have changed our vile body like it be unto his glorious body, according to the mighty work it shall be able to subdue all things of the Son. I heard the voice of the men saying, Right from henceforth, blessed are the dead which die in the Lord. Even so say this great for they shall rest from the labors. Lord, have mercy upon us. Christ, have mercy upon us. Lord, have mercy upon us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from all evil. Amen. The grace of our Lord and Saviour, Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit, rest and abide us all now and forevermore. Amen. 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 Rest in peace, my sister. Rest in peace. Come forward. I trust everybody can sit down by right now for the next two minutes. Good morning, my name is Clyde Charles and I happen to know Natalie Jacob, uh, Natalie's Jacob manager. And by no real mean, I can profess today to say that I would have known Natalie very, very well, but I would have known Natalie because I happened to manage Natalie over the last three years. And in that three years, I would want to bring greetings not only from the National Carnival Commission Security Department, who at this time is viewing this service at our VIP lounge. But I'm sure Natalie would have liked me to say it too, her two children, Dequan and Tadisha, I would want to say to you that every conversation that we would have had, she would have spoke so much of you, especially her daughter. I would have found out from Natalie that your success in school, and she was so proud of you. I would, I would want to say this to you this morning, that make your mother proud. Continue along the path in which you would have had in your formative years to pass your SEA and go to bishops. Take a, take a moment from today. We know that we lost Natalie at a very young age. Take a moment from today. And for her son, the same path and the same study path that you would have taken, encourage him so that he could probably attend Fatima College or Curiosity College. We understand that the stuff in which you would come from, it is not easy at this time for the both of you. Whatever, whatever comfort we could bring to you from the National Convert Commission, we want to extend that to you. As a family, we are part of your family now. We are, Natalie came into our life for three years, and we want to thank you all, Natalie family, for allowing her to spend those moments with us, for allowing Natalie to laugh with us, to share her many, many, many conversations with us. We'd have heard many conversations from the family. Natalie would have brought it to us and bring joy to our, to our hearts. But the, before I finish, I would want to say this. Just before Natalie was hospitalized, she became silent and quiet. In those quiet moments, a lot of things might have been going through her mind. Find someone, all of you, I'm, 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 I'm addressing you and I'm also addressing those who are looking on at this service at the Queen's Park Savannah. Find something or someone in those quiet moments to talk to somebody. Let them know what, is, what you're going through because somebody might be able at that point to direct you in the right way. Do not keep your silent to yourself. It would have been hard. Natalie was in pain in her last days. She was in pain. In fact, she was in pain. And once again, to you all, the Jacob family, Natalie, 
we want to say that thank you guys very much for allowing Natalie to pass the battle the last three years of her life at the National Carnival Commission. We hope we learn something from her death and it's not in vain. I want to thank you all very much and please, when you moan, if you cry, cry. If you have to cry, cry. Don't afraid. Nothing is wrong in cry. But after you cry, remember the things that was good. Develop on it. Build it. And I'm hoping in the I'm hoping somewhere in the future, I understand somewhere that we go to some some kind of university, some kind of college. Only please take care. Please take care and let us continue Natalie work. Yes? What a friend we have in Jesus.